I'm Asha Baker and I'm the Head of Research and Development at McPeel Glen Bervey, which is the UK's leading uh, independent food ingredient manufacturer. As part of my role, I manage a team of about 25 staff in research and development who launch an average of three new food products per week. Uh, in interviewing graduates and then looking for the next generation of our research and development staff, uh, all of the Aberdeen graduate attributes are important. Obviously, as it's scientific positions that I'm responsible for, we would focus in and want to see uh, a competence and a depth and breadth of competence in the scientific subject they've studied. Also, because of the nature of the work we'd be asking the graduates to do, critical independent thinking and analysis of problems and uh, proactive generation of solutions to problems is critically important. So academic excellence and critical thinking, imagination, proactive thinking, are central to the job of our research and development technologists and industry. However, we wouldn't employ someone that didn't demonstrate a respect of diversity in terms of gender or ethnicity or respect of diversity in terms of other points of view, uh, nor would we employ someone that wasn't committed, say for example, to continuing to develop their skill set. One of our recent uh, graduates that we hired into the role of research and development technologist is uh, Katrina Harrow. Katrina graduated with a first class honours degree in chemistry from the University of Aberdeen. I'm a research and development technologist at McPhee Glen Bervey. My role here involves developing new products, developing new processes, looking at the packaging of our products to give our customers the best possible combination of product and package. To my job just now, I think the, um, the section of attributes that's most important is the one about the critical thinking and communication. I use that constantly in my job, whether it's um, I'm, as I'm developing new products and we have issues, then I'm constantly trying to identify what those issues are and gathering the data and analysing that data and trying to come to solutions. Um, we also have to communicate all the time, we need to update our um, colleagues, we need to communicate with our customers, our suppliers. If we can't communicate effectively, then it doesn't give the company a good reputation. So it's vital that we use these um, attributes on a daily basis. When I was studying, the academic excellence was um, most important to me. I think the other attributes came second behind that, although they were developing the whole time that I was studying. So if I was to go back to university and do it all again, I think I would instead of focusing so much on my degree, which was obviously a very important part of being at university, I think I would have tried to um, do some more things, join more clubs and societies that would have given me the opportunity to meet more people, communicate with more people, network with people and build up more of the graduate attributes. My advice to any students is enjoy university, make the most of it. You won't get many more opportunities like university in the future. It's, it's a very unique environment. Go out and join lots of clubs, lots of societies, meet as many people as you possibly can. As you're doing these things, your attributes will develop all the time and you'll then um, be very attractive to employers in the future. <laughs>